Hello, all you Wookie Warriors. How's it going? Let me get all set up here. All right, just checking my audio. Just check it. Audio's good. There we go. All signed and sealed. I'm just going to check something real quick. All right, man, these pins are actually pretty heavy. All right, we are back with more God of War Ragnarok. Um, last episode we were in Smithelheim, I think his name it's called, um, the Land of the Dwarves. We had beaten the uh, Derek, Drac, kind of like a cross between a dragon and a lizard, I guess. Um, we had bought ourselves some new armor. It's actually, I really like this armor look, probably because it actually looks cool. I, I, I don't know, like, uh, the armor I get from, the, uh, I think it's called Rising Snow. I think that's, like, the pre-order. I mean, it kind of looks the same, but I, 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 I don't know. It just, I don't know, it just, eh. I don't know, I just don't like it. Don't know why. Maybe because this one actually has maybe detail and little, like, wolves on it. I don't know. Maybe it's the color. I don't know. I just don't like it. Um, wait, now it seems like um, 
I need to get more. I need to get this leveled up. And I think that's why my blades of chaos don't do as much damage because I don't have any blades. I don't have any flames uh, to make it better. Although I will say something, looks like they took out the uh, the design some the designs for these. Yeah, I can just show you guys better right here. So if you remember in God of War, the first the one before this one. Yeah. So actually, I believe the first after the first game, it actually got rune, uh, the same kind of runes that the Leviathan Axe had. So I'm wondering if the reason they took those away is maybe because they're like, okay, you're gonna have to start fresh and level it up all again, uh, level it up all over again. But um, I thought maybe since the Leviathan Axe itself still has those runes that uh, Sidri put on there. You know, maybe it would have had that. I don't know. Um, we'll see how, how things go with the game. Um, I would definitely like to see if I can get some armor that actually has, like, three in ones. Like, not just vitality, but, like, strength, defense, and rune. Um... Because I think that's kind of how I like playing. Is I I like being a versatile character. I like having, uh, like if I have, let's just break it down into magic. So if my chaos blades are magic, I'd like to have something going towards magic. Is one I'm going to want to play with my chaos blades. Um, but we don't really have anything to go towards that right now. But hopefully there's some armor that will let us do that. Um, I still haven't figured out how to get that one golden chest. Um, okay, you guys can kind of see I'm cool. Um, but I don't think there's much left here to explore. I don't think there's much left for me to find in this area. So what we are going to do is go on a magic train ride. A train that's obviously too small for Kratos. <laughs> I mean, I think everything in this area. Oh, uh, Diener. Yeah, covered in algae. I was thinking we could show it to Brock and Sindri when we got back. Here. Okay, so, we came here looking for Tyr because we don't trust Odin, right? If you think about it, or could. Uh oh. On your left. Oh, do not shoot me. Train. Huh? Any crash you're gonna walk away from? It's a good thing, right? Oh. Well, that's a callback from the old game. Right 
Is that a... Oh, that's the... That's the head. Now, here's my question. And I'm probably going to find the answer to this question throughout the game. Is... Is the quick game, is, are we going to get access to different looking shields, or are they all going to be basically the same thing? You know? This place is incredible. Whetstone of the night, the fact. When resisting an occupation, sometimes the most obvious methods are the best. It is old. No longer of use. But enough about you. I'm talking about the whetstone. I'm guessing we can't burn those away. So there's gotta be something. We don't have yet that lets us do that. Ryan, you okay, buddy? Hey, 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 don't like. fun. Look out! Look out! <laughs> <laughs> 
Oh, goody. So, point the mouth you had on the train, lad. It's just a word. I've heard way worse from... A word does not matter. You lost control. We were falling through the air. I thought we were gonna die. Is that what you truly wish your last word to be? No. In moments of crisis, panic does nothing. Harness it. Let it serve you. Dude. Kratos, if I'm falling, if a train is tumbling, rolling around, and we're falling, yeah, my word is probably going to go, oh, shit. Yeah, there, I just browned my trousers. I'm not going to have anything profound to say that's going to go, well, this is it, or something like that, you know. I'm not going to have, like, an action star commentary. Anything else you would like? Your bow, maybe? Yes, God and Wookie been looking for this game stream. <laughs> hey, Leo, how's it go? When? Looks like the water powers the crane that's keeping the cargo up. Yeah, like, what do you want me to do? I can't just freeze it. Who do you think I am? I, Mr. Free. Well, technically, I have to go back to that. So, yeah, I guess I could. I think freezing it could stop the water. <laughs> How far do I back do I have to go to freeze it? That's my question. Also, guys, sorry I'm running a little late. I actually overslept today. So I'm like, okay, I'll get up at 3.30, I'll go to the store, and I'll stream. But nope. I think I see a passage. If we can get through the sword. Did you tell me to get... PS4 Pro? Did you tell me to get the PS4 Pro wiki? Um, I said... I don't remember if I did. Only difference is if you get the PS4 Pro versus the original PS4, you get more of a memory. So I think it starts out with like a terabyte. Um, more power for graphics. Um, you know, here, let me just look this up. That way I'm not just throwing weird facts out of my head. Okay, so this is Tech Raider on the website. Hmm. 
That's what I'm looking for a chart. All right. Um, so for the PS4 Pro, you know, as far as the price point goes, you're looking at 400 for a PS4 Pro and $300 for just a regular PS4. Um, the Pro is going to be slightly bigger than the original PS4. Um, so it has the same processor, 8-core processor, and AMD Jaguar 86... A6, um, 86-64. So, the GPU, that's the CPU. So the CPU is going to be exactly the same if you got the PS4 Pro or PS4 original. The GPU um, is an AMD Raiden, I believe it is, uh, which is 4.2 teraflops for the Pro, and the PS4, this is a regular PS4, is 1.84 teraflops. Uh, system memory, 8 gigabytes, 8 gigabytes, so you, it's, it's going to be the same. Optimal port out, yes, so you have an optimal port. And then you have, on the PS4, you, a regular PS4, you don't. Um, internal storage, you automatically um, start out with one terabyte. The PS4 has an eight, 500 gigabyte and one terabyte. So um, I, I think it's a little bit more than $300 if you go for the terabyte, though. Um, AV op, um, opt, op, out, output, sorry. ATM optical or slash optical, and then you have the 2000 uh, PS4, just not the Pro, it's just a simple HDMI. Power consumption, uh, you have 310 watts, and then for the regular PS4, PlayStation 4, it's 160, 165 watts. Um, mass, I'm guessing that's weight, uh, 3.3 kilograms, the PlayStation 4, this is the, P the Pro is 3.3 kilograms, the, the PlayStation is 2.1 kilograms, uh, BD, DVD drive, yes and yes. Uh, 4K Blu-ray Blade Black, no, no on both. That's interesting. Um, 4K streaming, uh, which is yet yeah, uh, the PS4 Pro has it. The PS4 does not. Um, HDR output, both systems have it. AV out, um, HDMI and digital out, optical. And then the HDMI for the PlayStation. Um, USB um, times three, USB 3.1. And then PlayStation is times two, USB 3.1. So those are the specs. Um, so, I mean, I guess it really depends on you. If you don't need all the, the bells and whistles the PS4 Pro has, and you don't want to, and you don't want to spend the $400 to get a Pro, then you'd be okay with getting a PS4 regular. Um, I think depending on which retail you go to and who you go through, you can go to Amazon, um, Walmart, uh, Best Buy, whichever retail you want to go with. Um, I can honestly tell you, uh, like, let me just look it up quick. Um, the PS4 is probably, if you're going to go with the, uh, 
PS4 terabyte, it's going to be a little bit more expensive. Let me just see Walmart's prices. Oh, I probably get a PS4 console and I get PS5s. Okay, so Walmart's charging six fifty, and you're looking at three fifty for a five hundred. Because I don't think the website I was looking at it's changed prices for inflation. Best Buy. Yes, for a console. Why well, I keep I keep on getting never mind. I don't even see PS f and my internet just exited out for one some whatever for whatever reason. Um, I mean, unless you, uh, I think unless you go to like a website like Amazon, you're probably going to have to pay more. I've asked others, I want to make sure with my purchase of a new gen. Well, like I said, um, you just have to weigh the pros and cons. Um, the PS4 is, well, the thing is about the PS4, no matter if you go with the Pro or the original, the PS4, they're all getting, they're technically now the old consoles. I know, it's like, what? But, um... The only difference is there's a few new, few bells and whistles on the PS4, the uh, PS4 Pro that the PS4 does not have, and the PS4 Pro, uh, you, th there is no 500 or terabyte. It automatically has a terabyte, which is what I have on my console. Um, I don't have the website up anymore, but um, it, re it really runs down to price point. And where you want plan on getting it from. Like if you go to Amazon right now, for instance, I'm looking at Amazon right now. For a PS PS4 Slim one terabyte, you're looking at four hundred and nineteen dollars. That's just one retailer. Now for a PS4 Pro, this is also Amazon prices. This is not retail. Um, there's a seller. There's someone selling it for four hundred and sixty-nine dollars. So it really just depends on you. If you want the PS4, which has all the uh, bells and whistles that the PS, the original PS4 does not have, or you can go with the Pro, which has um, uh, uh. I think we said a bigger CPU and GPU, um, bigger teraflops, um, or more teraflops. Let me see if I can get that thing back up.
Ah, here we go. So I think the big price point, the big point is, okay, the CPU is exactly the same as the PS4. The GPU is more, has more tariff, so basically to simplify it, the teraflops are big, uh, the PS4 Pro has more teraflops than the original PS4. Um, power consumption is, is, is higher than the original PS4. Uh, you magically start with a terabyte worth of data. It has optimal port out. Um, it's slightly bigger. Has slight. Um, it says mass. So I'm assuming it's bigger than the PS4. Um, and it has 4K streaming. So, well, like I said, it, it, it's better, and it's it also has the same things as um, the PS4. The thing that, like I said, um, that you that has these probably referring to is the teraflops, um, which is your. Uh, GPU, so it has a bigger GPU than the original PS4, which would um, I think the GPU is what governs the, the like the download speeds. I could be wrong. I'm not a computer guy. I'm Like the AV, um, AV output um, is HDMI and optical. Um, a, uh, AV out is HDMI and digital out optical. I'm not high tech smart myself. Yeah, um, I got the Pro because for a couple of reasons. One, it had a higher GPU, you know, more teraflops. Um, it auto, I automatically can up, like I wasn't good. I had 500, and I think I had um, another drive to give me more. I think it was like a terabyte. So now I have upgraded my. Um, PS4 Pro, and that's the thing. You, well, I wouldn't recommend it. I'm sure computer ways can do it, but all you have to do is you can actually get more space. You just need to get a. Uh, I think it's like, I think mine was like a hundred, hundred fifty. Um, it's a storage compartment, like a USB drive. It's a, it's about yay big. Uh, hang on. I can't do it accurately with my hands, but it's like it's like a book size, maybe like, like a old cell phone size. Um, I think mine is like five terabytes, four or five terabytes. So I have so on my hard drive, I have a grand total of like four thousand gigabytes of space. I'm not going to download games, only physical copies only. Well, that's the thing, Leo. Um, even if you have a physical copy, it's still going to have to download onto the PS4. That's the thing. You can't, it's not like a, on a PS2 where you just plug it in, you just put the disc in and you play it. It has to copy the disc on the, the game from the disc to the console. So you're still downloading it. Um... Uh, yeah, um, I still like having my physical copies, but um, I it, it's still going to have to download. So you're still going to need to make sure you have enough memory to download the the games. 
Not to mention you're going to have to have space for if you're going to put DLCs or you're going to need it for save data. So if I miss the old ways, I do too, but also the old ways, like you had to worry so much about the discs. Like I took very good care of my discs and I, I check in and there's scratches. I'm like, how do, how do you get scratches? So I, I, I miss the old ways, but I also like the new ways because um, the Blu-ray disc can get micro scratches and they'll still play. I think my favorite console, and still my favorite console today, is probably the N64. I love that thing. I need to, I need to pl plug in my X64 at some point. Um, if you're asking my honest opinion, I think it would be worth going, if you can find a seller, maybe on Amazon, or you can find one at a decent price in the retail store, but even though I just looked at the retail stores, um, like Best Buy had none. It was all PS5. I'm like, no. Um, you would probably find a good, you might find a good deal uh, if you have a local GameStop ne near you. Although GameStop is oof, going way up the dodo. Like I, 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 like, I love going to GameStop. It was like my second home. But now, like, lately, like anytime I want to go get a game, I might as well just buy it online versus going to the store because they never have it. I never owned a 64. Ah, oh, 64 is awesome. Uh, so many good games for Super Smash Bros. Um, Mario 64, Zelda, Zelda Majora's Mask, Donkey Kong 64. Um, there's only... Star Wars, Shadow of the Empire. Those are just the ones I could get off the top of my head. But really good games for it. I think I saw one on Facebook for like a hundred bucks. Really cheap. But they're, they haven't gotten to the point where uh, some of the NES games have gone up. You have a game exchange store, yeah. So if you want to check, if you want to check your games, whatever your local game store is, and see if they have a PS4 Pro, and you can get it for a cheaper deal than what I um, what I said, because on Amazon the cheapest I found was like 160, 469 dollars. Um, the PS4 was like four hundred. 419 I think so if you can find one that's cheaper just make sure you test it make sure you hold on the receipt I mean if there's hopefully I don't know if your game store has a return policy of like 30 days or something like that but make sure you hold on the receipt and test the game test the system make sure the system works um Awesome. The PS4 um, will optimize to whatever TV you have. Um, so if, say, you're not running like a 4K TV, like right now I have a 4K TV. It, as I was running my PS4 on my old LG TV, which was not 4K, but it still gave me a good picture. Um, I, didn't, I didn't get this LG, I didn't um, get my Curve TV until... Oh... Uh, Three years ago, maybe? Perfect. Perfect. So, yeah. Um, just make sure you test it. Um, if you can get it cheaper, I would I would, rec I would, would recommend the PS4 Pro just because it has some more bells and whistles than the original PS4 does. Um, it has uh, more teraflops than the PS4. Um, you start out with a, te one th uh, a terabyte worth of space and internal storage which is amazing because you can you know have more games in there you can play long play more games you can have more me uh, save data in there um and if you're going with the playstation plus um That's two people for the pro. Yeah, I mean, I would recommend the pro, but on the other hand, like if you are someone who's looking for you, know, you know, have a budget and you're like, well, I don't know if I can afford the 
the I were on PS4, but I don't know if I want to pay the extra, say, sixty bucks to get to get it. Well, you'd be just fine playing on a PS4. But I would recommend getting the PS if you can afford it. I would recommend the PS4 Pro. Budget, yeah. Well, l- like I said, I, um, if you're on a budget and you like, well, I want a PS4. I just don't know if I can pay the the sixty, the extra sixty bucks for the PS4 Pro. Then you'd be just fine getting a PS4. I had a PS4 for a long time, even after the Pros came out, and I didn't get a Pro until Spider-Man Marvel. Um, that was when I got my PS4 Pro. PS4 Pro. I played Neo on it. I played all PS4 games on it until I got up to play uh, Spider-Man Marvel. Plus, you plan on selling your PS3 and 2? I mean, you could do that. I, I still have my PS3. It's sitting right there uh, on my te- next to my television. I, it's just me. I don't like getting rid of consoles. I, I would have kept my original consoles if I could of my PS4 and Xbox. Because I ended up selling those two to get the, the slimmer version of the Xbox. Which I believe was the Xbox X at the time. And then I got the PS4 Pro. That's where I sell the other one. My other one was a champ. Like, whew. Like, it, it did work. Like, it worked. So I gotta freeze that. Plus I'm selling my PS2 rule of rose. I meant since means fair last time I was at my local game store. I mean, like I said, you're free to, if that's what you want to do. Like I, like I said, for me, I just, I usually just keep my old, older consoles, and, and just because, like, I, for me, as I'm like, like a, more so, I'm just a collector. They are offered some, one five hundred. Wow, my game stuff doesn't offer that. That was 
Game exchange. Nah. Wow. I'm supposed to stop the uh, the water on this, despite what the little head on my butt tells me. Unless it's talking about freezing the wheel. But I didn't see the little thing to freeze the wheel. What do you think I'm going to be doing, Mr. Obvious? You do not need my help. Is this only on PS5? No, you can get this on PS4 as well. I don't think I can reach it. Well, not yet, anyway. Father, up there. <laughs> Great. I'll head across for a better look. Gate up here Never played God of War. Time. Oh, I love the friend. I love the God of War games. I first played it on the P. The first one on the PS One. Well, not a PS One. On PS Two. And then PS. They did the second game on the PS Two. They were gonna do the uh, the second one on the PS Three, but they decided to do it on the PS Four. And then God of War Three, which was on the PS Three. And then there's the portables, which I really didn't care for, to be honest. Um, then there was this, then it was God of War. Well, it didn't have any name, a number on it, it just said God of War. It technically is God of War 4. This is God of War 5. Um, uh, 
The thing is, the only thing is that the original God of Wars are not available on PS3. They're only available on, oh, I'm sorry, PS4. Um, do you, well, they now are, but you have to be a PlayStation Plus subscri- subscriber or PlayStation Plus Premium. If you can get up here, I'll need your help lifting it. If. Oh, come on. You can jump that. Your knees aren't that bad. Petraeus. Might you be able to freeze it? Alrighty. Missing something. No. Oh. It's another one of those wooden troughs. I wonder how the dwarfs thought of stuff like this. Aye. Might be the great motivator of convenience. Why do the work when you can get the wet stuff to do it for you? like I'm trying to start a war. Yet you do not say otherwise. Others? Maybe we can lay this to rest a bit, eh? I thought you were a god. Uh. 
Let me just try to trace this. We're gods! We can do anything! Maybe you can hit it from a different angle. And maybe you can go into the body. Looks like we found Darlin's mine entrance. And this looks like a boss arena. Got something else for you. Sindri! What is it? Since you're currently lacking a light source, sorry and have no way of seeing exactly what untold horrors lurk in the dark, these will help. Okay, back to your exploring now. Off with ya. Thanks, Sindri. Hey, wait, what do you mean by untold horrors? Where do you think you're going? Could have been worse. Huge cranes moving this way. Yeah. This is it. This is the mine. Intriguing. However, we're ill-equipped to do anything with it right now. Uh, I thought maybe Sindri gave us the the device to use it. The official entrance to the mine is blocked, but there's got to be another way. This way. Nice. Not a dead end. Come on, let's see where this goes. Ugh, these guys again? coming from I'm pretty sure I don't want to know it certainly smells like we're headed into a mine I 
think I can hear the water, too. Slow down, Atreus. Take care. Be ready. So, I think I found where those wretches were coming from. They will overwhelm you quickly. Stay close! All of them. <sighs> the smell these things leave behind is so gross. A small consequence for disturbing the home. I'll keep moving. We get a ride. I'm sorry. I know you said not to, but I can't stop thinking about this. We spend all of our time fighting bad stuff, and I don't get why we can't do that alongside Tyr. You do not know him. We saw his shrines. He's a leader. He stood up to Odin when no one else would. If he's done it before, why wouldn't he do it again? Images from long ago do not tell the whole story. Once we get off this, this reminds me of Knott's Berry Farm. It's gotta be close. I can't help but feel like you're angry with me or something. Ever since we got to Sparto Farm, you've been critical of my every move. If you don't think I can lead us, just say so. It is not your competence that is in question. Okay, but what does that mean? Consider your intent. This place is huge. Must have taken ages to build. Probably. Another door. We'll have to check that one too. Your instructions do not say which one. Nope, we're on our own here. Your question from before, about my intent. I intend to help the God of War stop Odin. And that means freeing him from whatever prison he's in right now. Brace yourselves, friends. Sindri? Oh. And be careful exiting that thing. One foot at a time, there are loose, rusty nails everywhere. Have you seen any signs of tear? As if I would navigate this maze of running sewage. No, I'm sure you'll manage that on your own. I don't know. The water looks pretty clear here. Keyword, Lux. At your service. Play to chaos. Oh, I have a chaos thing. Fire's actually a disinfectant, so these are very hygienic. Want something in particular?
Artifacts like these make you proud to be a dwarf. I'll be right back, guys. All right, I'm back. Whatever you need, I'll create. What can I make for you? Huh. That might be my best piece yet today. Very good. Gonna keep it spatter free this time, right? Kratos? Maybe. Just because you've got new armor doesn't mean you should let yourself get knocked around more. Look, there's a door just across the gap. Tear could be right there. Whoever wrote this certainly had an eye for detail. I'm noticing that the runes, they don't actually read them anymore. Sounds like you got the water moving along, brother. What next? That worked. The 
get to the door. Come on. Tear? Well, I certainly don't think this is where Tear currently is. He, he's got to be here somewhere. This mine is huge. Atreus. What do you intend to stop Odin from doing? You speak as if you know his plan. I don't know his plan. That's why we're... Ahem. Brothers, with Fimble Winter underway and Ragnarok around the corner, Odin will be desperate. Whatever he's planning to do surely won't be to the benefit of anyone but himself. Exactly. No, just because the place is huge doesn't make it mean that he's here. another door. Maybe that's the one. Glad we explored. Me too. How many doors are there down here? Not to be discouraged. Many. But it is a mine after all. Namir, that is discouraging. Uh, did you see that over there? There's a broken door up to the left behind this crane. Maybe Tyr tried to escape. We should look. Maybe you can use those wheels somehow. Outstanding! That overflowing water is burning the drain. Clever. Keep the lift fully powered up. We're almost there. We'll be up there in no time.
take that lift up. The gear can't be far. <clears throat> Okay, new exercise. Let's think about how Tyr's probably feeling locked up in his mind. If I were imprisoned by Odin and finally freed, Odin would obviously be at the top of my list. But I would just want to fight something. Anything. Even if it was just to know I still could. Tyr? Whoa, what happened here? Come on. They certainly weren't Tia. Best look around. This work didn't make it out. Is that a relic? Huh. Relic acquired. Relics provide special abilities to activate. Another empty vault. Ahem. Little brother. Perhaps it's time no, we... don't even say it. We're gonna find him. Look, another door on the other side of the cavern. Let's go.
believe we're above where we got off the boat by Sindri. This mine is one enormous spiral. I think I can hear something in there. How can I get up when I don't have a rune? <sighs> a statue. Not just any statue. That stony visage hung over the entrance to the world mill, built by Durin the Generous. Come on. Another drug of old brother. Nice! Stay here hard! Do not worry about me! Oh, 
Oh, come on! Why are the health pickups all the way up there? I ask you. I feel like if I I should like if I roll a couple of times the fire should come off me. Let me go get a rune. I dropped the chain down here. Hmm. Maybe not. <sighs> it's just a long way down.
can I even get back from where I came in? No. Oh well. I almost had it a few times. It's just that wombo combo he get that's unblockable he gets me with. Near there he has fire damage on me, it just doesn't go away. Gotcha. Just in the nick of time, too. What do we got over here? A golden chest? Chaos flame, cool. This mine is largely abandoned. It is unlikely. Here's here. I know it. Derlin's direction stopped at the entrance to the mine. We just have to keep searching until we find him. You said you'd follow my lead, and I say we keep looking. So knock it off. Watch yourself. I will follow, but I state what I see. Do not agree with me, but you will not speak to me this way. Are we clear, sir? <laughs> what happened? Why didn't that work? The chain is blocked. Should be clear now. Ready when you are. I'm never ready. One more door. <clears throat> that one has to be it. We will see. Seems like we'll have to get to it first. Water to power the wheels before. What's the chop? Well, that didn't quite work. Something else we can do? Let's 
keep looking around. There's got to be something else. I'm still watching. Glad you're still here, Leo. Hmm. So we have to... So we can't be two places at once, not with the Leviathan Axe. Well across. Look for another way. Okay. I think I see a crank over here. Atreus. Another mental exercise. Would one who spends their life fighting, such as Tyr? have any desire to prove themselves. The proof leaves a wake of destruction. But if the wake of destruction is a bunch of bad guys, why does that matter? You're strong, and you did the right thing. War does not measure the strength of a man. <laughs> I hope one day you understand. Hey, it looks like this machine is dropping ore into the water drop. <laughs> Hmm. The 
sewer's jammed and it's making the water overflow. Okay, now I get it. I didn't think the ore was gonna stay. Nah, I'm gonna go this way. There might be something over here. Treasure. We still have to go back and check out that last door, right? No. I'm telegram to be still. <laughs> Familiar. We're back in the spiral section of the mine. from over here. There's a passage leading out. I heard laughter. Do my words irritate you? It's fine. I get it. Brothers. Wait. Is that light up ahead there? Hey, this might be it. That door's bar. They must be trying to keep something in. You don't look like that to secure the spare bed pools. I see what we must do. Anyone else notice that's a really, really big door? Just saying. Yes, sir. Right side! 
Clearly they don't want us in there. This has to be it. Back to it then. You know, just because they don't want us in there doesn't mean that it's something good. I guess that is who we're looking for. this Odin what game do you play with me now we're not with Odin we're the good guys good just cut it Rather, let me try. Tiar. Tiar. Look, you know me, don't you? You... You killed Mimir! No, 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 no. Yeah, we, we brought him right back. You, stay away from me, you monsters! Stop! We need him! Wait! Question. We're supposed to be a god yet. Tyr can break through barriers yet we can't. Like the simple door like this. Oh. Never mind. Damn. 
That Bifrost is annoying. I'm about to get knocked around the bar, aren't I? Bifrost! Very carefully, brother! That's the last of them. Let's find your son. I'll add this game, this to the games I want to get. It's it's it really is a fun game. I mean, there's people that have like mixed feelings about it because it's more of an RPG, slower paced um, God of War game. But I really don't mind it. Um, like if you play the first three games, it, he's more acrobatic, he's more versatile than in this one. He's kind of just like walks around. He doesn't really jump a whole lot. He feels more like a tank, to be, be honest. Just leave me alone. Tear, listen, I swear we're not here to hurt you. We're just trying to get, get you away out. From me, please. Take you somewhere safe, I away from you. Odin. Show mercy. This is my father. We help people. I don't belong out here, please. It's worse when he's angry. Father! Are you not a soldier? Are you not a leader of men? Master yourself! My son brought us to this place. For you! Look at him! You. Why? You don't know me. I know what you stood for. You helped the giants. We're returning the favor. We? We are leaving. Are you coming with us? Taller. Here. Your statue in the lake. You had a spear. I thought you needed a weapon. Walking stick? No. A kind thought, but no. Thank you, no. But. Okay. I, I ran because I don't always know what's real. Sometimes there's a... His mind's no broken. That, brother. We live in strange times. Everyone hears him talk. We must return home. Definitely gonna have to revisit some of these areas. He's taller. <laughs> uh, everyone's taller than Kratos, it seems. Can you feel that? A wind blowing from over here. Maybe there's an exit nearby. Are there names by which I should call you? I'm a trace. <laughs> you already know I'm here. And that's my father, Kratos. How does the son of a Spartan come to speak for the Yotnar? My mother was the last giant in Midgard. Laufey? Laufey. I remember that name. She tried to help people, too. She's in the light of Alphine now. 
Holy moly, how's the weather up there? Uh, I'm, I'm guessing windy for him. <laughs> I would imagine there's got to be something, like an ability or something we're going to be getting. So we're going to have to come back and visit. See, it seems like. Dear, go open that door. Please, let me get that. Whoa. So polite, though. Odin's wrath to free me. Well, Ragnarok is coming. I hope you knew that. We thought you'd want to help. You freed me only to start a war? No! Um... Um... Sotia, it's good to see you in the flesh again. The mirror. What's become of you? Following in your footsteps. Betrayal, indefinite imprisonment, execrable torture at the hands of the Old Father. You didn't deserve such treatment. Did you? I will say my view was a touch better than yours. We found him at the top of a mountain with tree roots wrapped all around him. The only way to free him was to... Well, that. Highly pleasant. For all parties involved. You're... Ah, next to my ass, dude. Okay. The light. It's... It's been so long. There's an outcropping just ahead. The shade will make it easier on your eyes. Come on. You said Ragnarok is coming. Which means Balder. Balder is dead. Odin sent him to track down a giant in Midgard, and then he found Kratos. And... Anyway, I promised to take these two. He was looking for a giant, found us. Instead of asking nicely, he was a bit of a jerk. We asked him kindly to leave. He decided not to. We got into a big brawl, and it just became a big old thing. In the realms, if they chop off my head. And convince Freya to bring it back. Come here. Watch out! No, 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 no. all violence but you're the god of war i left that behind long ago if odin starts ragnarok you really wouldn't fight not even if i wished to god of war turns to pacifism oh coward What if Kratos is thinking of the, uh, the Norse god of war? Before we go any further, the truth. What is it you want from me? You speak of Ragnarok. 
Is it a god of war you came to find? Is that the tear you need? Atreus. I... I am grateful for my freedom. But if you want me to follow you to war... ...or worse yet, lead you to it... ...then kill me, now. My fight is gone. Damage is done. No one's killing you, brother. Better that than to live to see Ragnarok. We do not seek war. We just want some answers. I don't know how to help you. It doesn't matter. The Giants trusted you. That's the tier we need. We need you. rest and maybe some food I think you killed the guards bringing me dinner brother perhaps now you'd like to finish the story the sons of Thor attacked us we killed them Balder tried to kill Freya I killed him. But you skipped over how he fought and freed the Valkyries. And that the giants are all gone. And now they called me Loki. And finding the shrines. The giants and... are gone. When we got to Jotunheim, they were all <clears throat> dead. Dead. Do you think Odin? We do not know. I think we're getting out of here not a moment too soon. Whoa. What are those? Reinforcements from Asgard. The Ain Hriar will want to investigate my disappearance thoroughly. Are they using the sky to travel between realms? Odin's got tricks up his sleeve we haven't dared to consider. They're coming down on neither Valir too. Will the dwarves be okay? The time for such concerns has passed. We must leave. Now. I wonder what happened to Tyr and make him this way though. It can't be just Odin's torture. I hear you. That's a highly that's highly possible too. I mean from what we understand from the rich, from the story is that he was a god not just of war but of peace. sound familiar. The giants are... were... very private people. Makes sense. Perhaps after a rest. Maybe we should tell them that we Traitors. jumped off. Lord Tyr! You're really alive! Am I? I wonder. Okay. He's just tired. I promised him some food and a room to rest in. Ah, of course you did. Well, let's see what we can do. Please, come inside. Uh, we'll be right in. Well, I'll be. So, can we talk? 
about what to do next? There is much to consider. We will speak in the morning. Oh, okay. In the morning. You hold still! Yep. Are you? Oh, Did... Much better. Thank you. I guess. Sleep tight, Tyr. I'm gonna turn in. Big day tomorrow. So, Tyr. Sounds like promises were made. Let's see about getting you settled, shall we? If you'll follow me. Hey! Come see what I got for you. I'm sure we won't be interrupting any goings on. I'll arrange accommodations. So that's what's left of Tyr, huh? Back where I come from, we'd say he's been through a few spaces. Mm. So have we all. Well, ain't you philosophical? That's all I need. To be honest, that's all I can manage. All right. Um, nothing much. Perhaps a heart attack. Sorry, yeah. Any sort of pain is just this. Ah, you're sorry. Let's see what I can find. Perhaps I'll be able to sleep tonight. Really sleep. The sleep of a free man without the All Father's eye on me. You know what? They must be in the pantry. I'll just look quietly. Yes, open the pantry. Let's go in there. Hey! What is it? A secret pantry? What are you thinking, brother? thinking I want things to be the way they were well I'd like to claim a tree again certain ships have sailed I just wish Atreus were not so restless I care only for your safety I know brother but Holding him too tight won't keep him out of danger. The lad's determined to make a few mistakes of his own. And I hate to say it, I think Tyr might be one of them. I've never seen a man broken so completely. His pain is fresh. Expect too much. Aye, perhaps. Pretty if Freya still wants to kill you. That's an ally we could use. That is not an option. I suppose it is. Trouble sleeping. Ah! Shh. You cannot sneak up on me like that. There's something I had to do in Midgard. What? Without me? I thought we were partners. Oh no. Just. <laughs> you want to join me. <clears throat> I'm visiting an old friend. Oh, I see. Or possibly not doing that, taking into account she's determined to murder you. She wouldn't really. I think it's lovely that you see the best in people. I really do. And I want you to continue to see the best in oh, people no. by not getting yourself murdered. <gasps> but we need her. It's worth the risk. Is it? Oh, no. He's going to go after Frey. How about I suggest an alternative? Something much less risky, but maybe could give you some answers. What are you talking about? A certain old friend you haven't seen in a while. A very giant friend. Jormungandr? Did you find him? Why don't I show you? It's just on the way to the vengeful goddess who wants you dead. So it'll give us some time to decide about not going there. So, you know where Freya is? No, no. 
I mean, yes, but look, let's just talk to the snake first, and then I won't take you to Freya. How's that sound? Oh boy, Kratos is not going to be happy about this. <laughs> Uh, although it's nice we actually can take control of Atreus in this game. Glad you brought your key of Yggdrasil. You seem to have dashed out without mine. Huh. You got sick of having house guests that fast? What? No. I could just use some fresh air. Is all. Well, I hope you like it cold. Should we swing by your cabin first? Will your furry friend be joining us this time? Uh... No... I, I meant to tell you... Fenrir's dead. Oh... I'm very sorry to hear that. As wolves go, he was always... very clean. <laughs> Thanks. I'd offer to give you a hug, but... why traumatize either of us further? Caught a whiff of something awful near the Helheim Tower. Remember how to get there? Yep, just past the oarsmen. But that's what makes you think Orman Gander's nearby. Oh, that's cool. Frozen lightning. Okay. Well, a lot's kinda happened, and I need answers. gonna break that thing okay genius well what are you looking at me for I gave you the fancy bowstring true so, what's been going on so father said I cast a spell when Fenrir died but I don't know what he's talking about Accidental magic? That is disquieting. <sighs> Accidental magic's not all. I sort of turned into a bear. A bear? Including the slobber? Yeah. Then I lost control. Frey knows magic better than anyone. You know, they're not giant. Fine. We'll do it your way then, Sin. A huge venomous snake seems much safer. Venomous? Uh, yeah, but he hasn't eaten any. One just doesn't like Thor. Soundstone on it, too. Oh, yes. Feels good, right? It's great, Sindri. <gasps> no way I'm lifting that. Maybe with some help? Well, don't look at me. Who knows where it's been? I still think that's really freaking cool that the, the lightning right there is all frozen. You can even see the lightning still passing through it. That's pretty cool. We're blocked. How'd the arm of tear statue end up here? Find a way through, and I'll tell you. I'm on it. Huh. Looks dwarven. It is soundstone, but the path's still blocked. I don't see any more on this side. Hold on. Let me look around. Maybe I need a different angle. <gasps> oh, 
of Tyr's arm. Your father owed Thor a blood payment, and, well, he got it. Wow, great story. Anyway, is that likely to happen again? Sudden, uncontrolled, bear rampage? Beats me. We've got company. Got my back? They're literally made of filth. I'm not touching... Who said you need to touch them? I like the way you think. Okay, here goes nothing! Yup! sacrificing so many objects from your bag of tricks. Well, you clearly need the help. Oh, whatever. Shoot. I think the lift switch is broken. Not for long, I guess. You can fix it. Can't you? Or does your brother have all the talent after all? Depends. Is your father all the muscle? If I say yes, you realize you're confirming Brock has all the talent? <sighs> How does he carry all that in a bag? Why are you worrying so much today? I just need to look out for the people I care about. It keeps bad things from happening to them. Freya wouldn't kill me. Njormungandr's probably not even there. Besides, he likes me. He's only eaten me once. I had conveniently scrubbed that from my memory. Well, we're here. Well, let's see where the giant snake is. The horn's still there. Told you he's gone. Well, have you tried calling him? Blowing the horn's the first thing we try. I'm not talking about the horn. Your mute you say. That's not weird at all. Shh. Ah. Morning. Hope you brought him some coffee. Well, there goes one guy's theory. It was under the the ocean, the under the water. <laughs> I 
I just hope he's not gonna be cranky. This is your idea, sir. Like, why did you wake me up? I was having a wonderful dream. Should have stayed home. Let's head back. So before the game came out, there was a. Let me go. Let me see if I can take control of it. Try this. So there was. So there's part. Uh, so there's part of the snake, but. Everyone, the, the video I was watching, they theorized that the big snake was completely under the ice, which he, so he couldn't, he wouldn't be in the game. But I'm like, nah, the, the snake's going to be in the game. He's a really big snake, so not all of him's going to be underneath the ice. But I'd imagine probably the snake was like, I'm sleeping, I'm hibernating, why are you waking me up? And I think that's... That makes me wonder what happened to the snake, because in times past, like, you'd be able to see, like, where the snake was. But at least we got a scene with it. Only to say... Maybe I can... You're gonna break that thing, dude. Would you just let me do it? So what was your plan, anyway? Just stroll up to the old Valkyrie Council Circle and hope Freya's in a good mood? Well, now that I know where she is... Yeah, exactly what I'm gonna do. Fuck! I think it's the first time I've seen him swear. He's unbearable when he's smug. Look, Balder tried to kill her. We had no choice. I'm not sure she sees it that way. Well, I'm not gonna ask her. Besides, they were your arrows. You're absolutely right, which is exactly why I'm recommending we don't do this. I mean, no offense, dude, but that was her child. I don't think there's anything you guys are going to be able to say to convince her or otherwise.
Ah, nuts. Well, that's quite an excitement for one day. No way. We're so close. Oh, Kratos is not going to be happy. Maybe this is a sign. Don't be a baby. I'll catch you. Promise not to drop you this time. He drops him. I... Fine. Just step between the realms then. You know it doesn't work that way. Though sweet vessel, I wish it did. <gasps> See? Was that so bad? I sincerely hope I never have to do it again <laughs> if that's what you're asking. Funny as how Kratos used to do it with you. My shop. Well, if I can't stop you, then this is as far as I go. I'm gonna stay and fix this. Suit yourself. All right, I'll be right back, guys. All right, I'm back. I think Kratos, I think Atreus needs a sword or something because he's just gonna break that bow. I mean, it's not invincible. That's over here. I don't think I can break this. We need to find another way around. You sure you want to go in there wearing the very arrow tip that killed her son? I'll hide it under my shirt. And besides, it's a reminder to be better. You need a murder weapon to be a better person? It makes me feel brave, okay? Is that such a bad thing? When it leads you to believe you can convince Freya of anything, yes, it is. I have to try. Oh. This is not going to go well. Hit the fire pot. Wait. Just keep going. Are you sure this is a good idea? You haven't got a plan. Brock says some people run better on chaos. I think he's right. What makes you think that applies here? This is life and death. And this is Ragnarok. We can't just do nothing and we're out of options. Living. Living is an option. <laughs> oh, I miss the banter these guys have. 
I guarantee you, if Ragnarok was like a massive like dirt, like it makes everything dirty, he's like, I guess we'll have I'll have to do something. Okay. I can't live in dirt. As long as I go up and forward, I think I'll get there eventually. Yeah, sounds right. Sounds like you're lost. I gotta feel like Kratos is gonna find out and he's like he's on his way to help. Like Sindri goes and fetches Kratos. Sonic piece first. All right, I just need to get a different angle on the soundstone. Like that. Oh yeah. I wouldn't have to hide things if he'd just trust me. How can I trust you if you lie? Actually, that's a good point. <laughs> <laughs> Arguing with, with yourself and actually agreeing with the person. Listen to me. Could I not say the same? Well, where do you think I learned it from? Won't you tell me? <sighs> Not that he doesn't trust her. I think it's it just probably thinks you're not ready here yet. Nothing here. 
So it looks like we go up. Follow the deer. Bad deer, you led me into a nightmare. I'm more concerned with what kind of a warm welcome. I'm just wondering what welcome we're going to have when we reach our destination. Damn it! <laughs> that shield guy is pissing me off.
There we go. I got this, right? Yeah. shouldn't be much farther now. Oh, 2000 for that. Just need to look out for that big door. What big door? Changing my mind. Ha! You do have doubts. Huh? Hey! Like you never do? Better than having regrets. I'm not sure I agree with that, but by all means, keep going and you might find those too. <laughs> yep. That's Just the door. be sure to scream if she starts killing you. Thanks. I feel so much better now. Hang on, guys.
Okay, no good. No worries, guys. All back. Uh, my sister's on the phone. I didn't want pri her private conversation being broadcast. Hey, Freya. What? Can't I pay an old friend a visit? Nothing wrong with that, right? I mean, just because I'm responsible for the death of your son doesn't mean... Okay, yeah. She probably would mentioning that. Is that Freya? Why am I wearing this around my neck? The arrow tip that killed your son? That's a great question. Uh, I'm so dead. Yep. That's nothing. Boy, she moved her house all the way over here. That's interesting. Poor turtle, though. Freya! You should have stayed with Sindri. Wait! Stop! Your father. Where is he? Not here! He sent you? No! He doesn't know! You shouldn't have come. He took my son. What Gosh. makes you think I won't do the same? You're better than this! And bye bye. You would stake your life on it. <laughs> what do you know of me? I know you haven't killed me yet. So while you're thinking it over, why don't you let me go and I can tell you why I came? You mean to plead for your father, save your breath, his fate. Is sealed. But you know who's to blame for everything. I cannot get to Odin. Nor do I need to. Ragnarok will take him. Yeah? Well, what if I told you that he came to Midgard? He came to us. Offered peace if we don't move against him. Claims Ragnarok's already been averted. He lies. Maybe. But if you know Gro's prophecy, you know it depends on an army of giants. The giants wait for war in Jotunheim. No. I've been there. There is no giant army. There are no giants at all. Just me. You. In Jotunheim. We learned the truth. My mother was the last guardian of our people in Midgard. And... and that's not all. The giants have prophecies about me. They know me as... Loki. I think maybe... I'm supposed to... help stop Odin. Somehow. But since all the giants are dead and... you won't fight Odin... And he's already won. Why aren't we working together? Now that you can fight again! I am far from whole! Okay. Okay. What we found here... Maybe if you spoke to him... Here's a lie? Yeah. We... we broke him out of Swartalfheim. Impossible. The Nine Realms are closed to all. No. We opened up the way. We just don't know where to go next. But if we all band together... Enough. Enough! Enough. 
Leave this place. Go and do not return. Go before I change my mind. Do not expect the same mercy for your father. Well, that went better than I thought. We're still alive. And we lost our necklace. Jeez, how sharp does that thing have to be? It's not going to happen, but hey, at least we're live. Okay, so I'm not dead. I didn't get any answers. So this all might have just been a very big waste of time. Mm -hmm. Never, ever admit this injury. Well, we did get one clue from the snake. He said ironwood. Climbing. Interesting, since we were the one that carried you pretty much all, well, Kratos carried you all last game. Oh, thank you, Mir. You're all right. How did it go? Starting to... Sindri, I told you I could handle it. But I don't think she's going to help us. Uh, where's your necklace? Huh? Oh! I was thinking and I, uh, got rid of it. She took it, didn't she? Uh... Today was your lucky day. So, tell me, how did it feel to run on chaos? I... Hey, you just fixed it too. Or something else tries to kill us. Yeah, good idea. Hate to bring it up, but are we telling your dad about this? Since you've come clean and all. No way. He'd kill you. Right. Well, speaking of coming clean, I need your opinion on something. Something I've kept from my brother for a long time. I'll tell you on the way back. Come on. Secret he keeps from his brother? Shocking.
waiting for the bills to be paid first before I go and spend more money. Okay, back to Alphine Tower. You were saying? Long before you were born, there was an accident at the forge. Brock died. I couldn't accept it. I went to the Lake of Souls in Alfheim to steal him back. Legions of souls tried to stop me. I can still feel them crawling all over my skin. Thing is, I could only get three of his four soul parts back. Sindri. Brock just thought he got knocked out. I've been lying to him ever since. It's been eating at me lately. You have to tell him. He has a right to know. When the time is right. As should you with your father. That's not the same thing. Really? Now? Stop uh. Anyway, you did a good thing. You saved Brock's life. I caused trouble. No. I made a choice. One that wasn't mine to make. What do you mean? A choice? I... I couldn't be alone. The other dwarves, when they saw him, they shunned us. So we left. Made our own home. Well, you can't change the past, but it doesn't have to be who you are. Let's go home before Father wakes up. That might be the best idea you've had all night. Trey. Trey? It's an... Shut up. So I'm not allowed to give you a nickname? Is that what that was? <laughs> Whatever, Loke. Nope. That was worse. Ugh. And I heard it when I said it. All right. Shall we? Tyr was such a failure. Just wanted now to... Now hang on, little Jotun. Tyr may not be everything you expected, but a failure? You saved him from a terrible fate. That's not nothing. And hey, maybe he'll be some help to us yet. Maybe. But Father's not gonna go along with this forever. He's probably already got our next hiding place all picked out. Well, let's not make it worse by getting caught. When we get there... I'll cover our tracks at the gateway and slip around back, and you just act natural, but quickly. Well, what are you doing? You know it's not safe to leave the path. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. Just like to look over it sometimes. Concerns me. Do we try? 
us the path they would put us on. I trust their wisdom, and this is the closest thing to hearing directly from them. You are certain the Giants would not cause a war? I said that they were wise. In my experience, that goes with being peaceful. Oh, little brother. Told you we needn't worry. Atreus, where have you been? Peeing? Hope you're all hungry. I could eat. Is everyone as well rested as I am? Be right down. Is this sausage? Uh, sure. Why not? I remember food tasting better. I suppose you'd like to try cooking for this lot. I accept. What? Mm. Atreus, where are I planning our next move? Oh, so where are we going? Alfheim. Home with the elves. Alfheim? You hate Alfheim. Why would we move there? Move there? Oh, we are. Seeking information. The shrine of Groa, young one. Your father tells me you found it there. Groa? The knowledge keeper? Oh, maybe there's a secret there I can unlock. Aye. Who better than the seer who saw everything? Hmm. I wasn't sure you, um. Never mind. That's great. How fun. Hmm. Hey, don't go forgetting this, what'll get you there. You know what? I'm gonna build a bigger table. <laughs> that must have been one big P he must have been taking. I forgot I had my mic muted for a second. Tear, you're really up for coming with us? I am. Whenever you're ready. Well, Whenever your father's ready, I should say. If my counsel might help you towards the answers you seek, it's the least I can do to repay you. Plus, I think it will do me well to see the light of Elfheim again. Hmm. That elf light is some good shit. plan come from? Oh, from Mimir, of course. I was merely asking how you found me. He explained the secret prophecies inside the Yodnar shrines. Fascinating. From there, we set to taking stock of which shrines we'd seen, at which point your father recalled finding drawers outside the Temple of Light. And now that we can actually go to Alphite, the prudent course of action became self-evident. Nary a last step for the world's smartest man. Even without feet, if you'll forgive the levity. I was always fond of her talks, you know? Aye. And it's good to see you a free man again, old friend. He really did it. Tyr really slept in my broom closet. Is that normal for you tall, godly sorts? Or just the ones locked up for a lifetime or two? Um, okay. Not exactly what I would think for an accessory. Kratos? And Atreus? What'll it be? That belonged to one of the rebels, didn't it?
Right behind you. I'll meet you at the gateway presently, friends. Oh, this is not going to go well. Excuse me, sir. The squirrel. Don't mind if I take a little peek at you? I promise I'll be brief. What? My goodness, what a strapping physique. Capable of an astounding variety of acts of violence, I imagine. What is happening? Uh, this must be the squirrel that tends the wall tree. That delectable aroma. Could it be? Pardon the intrusion. Mm. Ah, yes. Amber resin. Delightfully nutty with a hint of squidding. No. Not one for gastronomic expiration, I see. Wait, if you're Raditz Hosker, why are you so different when we summon you for help? It's a long story. <laughs> but you are correct. I am indeed Raditz Hosker. The one you know as Raditz Hosker is merely one of my spectral aspects. And a particularly nasty one at that. I consider him so far removed from myself that he's practically a different person. Speaking of... Bitter, would you like to come out and see your friends? Back off! I'm busy! I suppose that was to be expected. Anyway... Mm, now that I've polished off all this resin for you, would you like the seed back? It is the seed. Indeed. A seed of Yggdrasil, to be precise. Mm. Since my dwarven tenants performed their little reconfiguration, you'll need seeds like these to open up new destinations on my tree. <laughs> Your tree, huh? Yes, my tree. Here, let me show you. That's why good Master Brock needed an Alpine seed. Clearly, you have important matters afoot. That seed you found unlocks Niflheim, of all places, a realm as ancient as it is vaguely sticky. If we're not going to Alpheim yet, it's probably best for Tyr to wait for us here. The soldiers we fought in Svartalfheim, those were Enriar? I thought Enriar were just spirits in Valhalla until Ragnarok comes. They were no spirits. Indeed, brother. Odin appears to have found a loophole. Activated his forces early as a standing army. Perhaps something he could only do without any honest Valkyries around to stand in his way. But I thought we sent all the Valkyries back to Valhalla. Oh, cool. Do we have to be here? Creeping me out, all these poor bastards with their souls cut up. Uh, Brock, what do you think about fate? I don't. Either your life's all written down somewhere or it ain't. Still feels like you're making choices either way. The shit smells the same regardless of how it got shat. Remind me to write that down. There's something over here. Ah, a memory of war. You could use this as a training arena if you like. You'll just be fighting the recollections of enemies. They won't be able to harm you. I think I have to do it. There's nothing. Yeah! 
How many of these am I fighting? something more going on here. Eighteen. Twelve. Okay, so... What are we at? The griddle, the griddle of the uh, ravens too. I'll have to see what else we get from it. I suppose we should continue to destroy any of Odin's ravens when we find them. So at least we get something for destroying all 48 of them, because last time it's just that we didn't get that. But it seems like the ravens are... But there's just some that I can't seem to get because I can't stop and throw the bow through my axe. 
Oh, Niflheim. So this is what happened to Niflheim. This is the area of the toxin. Melmi is currently locked. So hopefully we'll get some ability, some more abilities, and there's got to be something. Sounds weird, but can you tell me again what happens when someone dies? Every living thing has a soul, and every soul has four pies: form, mind, direction, and luck. Direction steers the souls of giants, dwarves, elves, and animals toward the lake of souls in Alfheim, where all the parts may be absorbed back into Alfheim's great light. So that's where Fenrir is? The Lake of Souls? So long as his soul still has its direction, I... It's well on its way. He remembers. Right, brother? Of course I remember. in need of my services and I am not present, I have installed these handy chimes for you to notify me. Simply throw your axe and strike the chimes and I will attend to your needs. Would you care to take a practice throw? A magnificent throw, Master Kratos. Truly a seasoned pro. Very well. You know how to reach me now. But putting all that aside for the moment, is there anything else? I have a question. Splendid! I delight in offering my tutelage to the Inquisitive. Over the ledge, by the gateway over there. I noticed these dragons. Dragons! Oh no, young Master Atreus. Those are leaned worms, the brood of Nepo. Nepo? That's the mother? Correct! She's also a vital piece of the Yggdrasilian circle of life, as it were. I tend the branches up here, while Nepo chews the roots from below to prevent overgrowth. A delicate balance. So they're friendly? Well, they're not nearly so affable as myself, but there's no reason to expect hostility so long as they're left in peace. Nithog is a stern matriarch, as protective of her offspring as she is determined to teach them proper discipline. That sounds... familiar. Hmm. Please come back anytime. I don't remember seeing dragons or worms. When you are, father. Unless you wanted to finish something in Svartalfheim first. No, most of the other stuff I wanted to get, I don't know if I can get to it right now. Tried coming with us, but Odin cast a spell on her. She 
can't leave Midgard. That's terrible. So then we fought our way through an army of Dark Elves to get to the light. You interfered in the Elf War. Not by choice. We sought to fill our Bifrost, and they attacked us. And the Dark Elves were covering it with their sticky hive stuff. When we freed it, the Light Elves came back. We seemed better in Alpha. <laughs> Did they now? I wonder what Tyr would say when we try going through the ledge. <laughs> <laughs> hey, here. This is the place we use your Unity Stone to reach where you hit the Yoden up there. Oh, yes. So much trouble I went to trying to protect the giants. Did it work? I guess. I'm not sure. I don't know, something seems off about the guy. Someone had a theory that maybe that really wasn't Tyr, but more like... a clone? It's been so long. Not sure where the temple is from here, but that's where we'll find Groa Shrine. Broken history. Aye, not exactly an easy fix for that. See the elves continue their war. Yeah. So much for things being better in Alpha. <laughs> Yikes. Thimble Winter hit Alfheim hard. No. Storms have plagued Alfheim's deserts long before Thimble Winter. Living desert. Hold on. I hear something out there. Something big. It's in pain. What do you hear? Feels like some kind of animal. How could anything live in a storm like that? Plenty of caves under the desert. Not exactly a paragon of comfort, but the Dark Elves get on best they can. <laughs> Now I know what I'm looking for. Okay. Hi, old friend. Just looting the army of chests. We'll be right along. My dad likes loot. Who doesn't like loot? Very well. <sighs> there. The Temple of Light. Groa's shrine is at the top. Freyr never bothered returning to Alfheim, did he, Mimir? Aye, no. 
I assumed the fate of his own realm took precedence. Wait, Freya's brother? Yes. Cut from a different cloth than that one. <laughs> There's a barricade up ahead. What are those shiny rocks? Twilight stone. A rare material that can take millennia to form. Majestic, isn't it? Occasionally, the light of Alfheim will bind to a rock and crystallize, growing like moss on a fallen tree. Truly a wonder of the Nine Realms. Yeah! There's a gap in the fence over there. Oh, I didn't know it could do that. Thank you. Cavassia's poems. Freya's brother. How was he involved? Long ago, Freyr of the Vanir traveled to Alfheim, where he discovered a once beautiful land devastated by war. Using his divine powers, he set about cultivating a tenuous peace among the elves. Did you mention how that peace fell apart as soon as he left? I was getting to it. You hear that? Oh, no. That's enough, please. You don't need to do this. We don't want to hurt you. We do not have a choice. No! Whoa, is that a bomb? We're the ones who freed the light. <laughs> Because we're intruders now. Hey, Alpha. Let's 
Is there truly no other way? Not like they're giving us much of a choice. So your father said. I'm just naive, I suppose. No. Just an optimist, old friend. A tribute to Freya, made by the elves. He must have left it here when he raced back to Vanaheim. What is this? A charm to ward off nightmares. In this case, the elves. Well, knowing the elves, there are probably more tributes to find. Best we move on for now, brother. Don't think we have the right tools for this one. Guess not. It's so tall. We came in from the top last time. I didn't realize all this was even down here. It's an older gate, built to promote cooperation between the elves. But it looks like it's been sealed for some time. How do we enter? Grab that wheel and I'll show you. I'll go first. Atreus, let me know when I've reached halfway. So, uh, what's happening right now? This seal is meant to represent the balance of the realm when Freyr was here. Light and dark, working together in harmony. How's that look, Atreus? Good, I think. Father... Unfortunately for Alfheim, Freyr couldn't accept his sister's decision to marry Odin. He returned to Vanaheim and left his realm to its fate. To be fair, the Aesir did set him on fire that one time. The door should have opened. Are you sure it's balanced? Yeah, but the realm isn't. Not anymore. Father, try pulling it the other way. Yeah, yeah, and here, you keep pushing forward. Fine work, Atreus. Shall we? What's a Dark Elf statue doing in the Light Temple? That's just how they looked before the Division. The Division? Yes. The Elves weren't always split between Light and Dark, you know. This statue depicts the Elves before the war, before they discovered the power of the Light. So what were they before? Just elves? Solid light. Guess some things don't change. Above the door, there's a light crystal. Doesn't work anymore. Guess we could just try breaking it. Here, that usually works. Maybe it needs some extra oomph. Kratos, try throwing your axe at that twilight stone. Yes. The stone briefly imparts a bit of light to your axe. That's useful.
that sound? No sense in spoiling the surprise? The light. Ah. I've never seen the Lake of Souls so volatile. Aye. Fimple winter, you reckon? Of course. Making the light unstable. So the base of this light well, that's the Lake of Souls. Yes. After the creation of the Nine Realms, fallen souls began to gather down in those waters. When the elves discovered its potential, they built this temple to harness that energy. A smashing success, to say the least. Many of them became addicted to their newfound power, and thus, the Light Elves were born. So, then the Dark Elves are technically the original Elves? Oops. I guess it would be too much to ask if that was right if we could do it just right there, but Maybe a different angle? Well done. Though I imagine our light out friends will be less than pleased. No, they should have kept the doors open for us. Speaking of light elves, let me try talking to them again. They Best may just to let these two do their thing, brother. Poor 
poor souls. Here, they came across on my bridge. But now the bridges are gone. I have an idea to get us across. Oh. Lucky for us, swearing off violence doesn't mean he can't disfigure some architecture. This way, shrine awaits. Kratos, where are you going? He's just looking around. I'm desperate sometimes. Ah, curious mind. Carry on. Yeah, I didn't, it was so different than I remember. It was all broken and covered in hive stuff last time we were here. These elves use Alfheim's light to enhance the temple, and themselves by the look of it. They definitely look more dangerous than last time. Oh, those were just the foot soldiers. They'll get more dangerous the further up we go. Great. So if these elves use the light to build doors and make themselves stronger, what do the dark elves want with it? To return it back to its source. To them, the natural resources of Alfheim are sacred, none more so than the light itself. Aye, the light elf's success came at a terrible price. Alfheim's once lively desert withered into a storm-ridden wasteland soon after the creation of this temple. So, essentially, we just kind of did... There's more Twilight Stone up there. So essentially, we just help the, uh, I guess you can call them the bad guys. More inspiring lyricism from the mind of Gracia. More light elves ahead. I'll handle this. Uh, maybe that's not a great idea. <sighs> oh, there, friends. Salutations. We mean you no harm. Tear. Get back. they keep fighting the dark elves want the souls and the light left alone the light elves want to keep using them that's the long and short of it aye so then which side is right rarely is it so simple and not our place to say this is an elven conflict i said as much the last time we were an elven right.
I don't know. I mean, it seems to me the dark elves were what they were. The light elves seems like they're just really addicted to the light and want to keep using it. But... I don't know, I guess it's hard to... Hard to say. Aye, none too eager to let the Dark Elves run the roost again. I think that's the way up to the shrine. We know. There's a chest over here. Oh, I see it now. Forgive my impatience. Oh, tricky. your axe behind this crate, right? I don't mean to speak out of turn, but the white marble wall behind that grate, perhaps your axe can reach it. Thanks, dear. My pleasure. And what did we get? Glad we explored. to it then. <laughs> oh, come on out loud. Why not simply hold it in place? Seriously? Behind you! Ah. 
What became of Kavasir? Ripped apart by his audience. Well, one member of his audience. Well, Thor. Shocker. Yes. You know what's down here, though? I mean, it looks like it's, I just opened up a shortcut. Ah, chest. They must have anointed a new temple guardian. Sparta, he offers counterpart. Dark Elf King. Yes, he's in the light now, too. You gotta be kidding me.
I'll be right back.
Ah, I see. The timing must be precise. Here they come. Do what you must. Hit the light on! statue, these crystals. I've noticed them on the elves as well. Oh! Crystals still make light bridges. Now the light elves wear them. Smart. Almost there. Allow me. I dare say he's beginning to enjoy the vandalism. Pretty soon he'll be laying waste to pottery. Shall we continue? Well, at least we're getting closer. Look up. See? It feels even taller on the inside. Can't believe all this was down here. Why must they insist on these frustrating? You would know better than us, brother. 
I can't remember the last time I visited the Nords, nor do I wish to try. Seeing it again. Well done. And here we go again. And here we go again. Go! 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 Go!
This is the last. Another light door. There's some twilight stone on that statue shield. But that angle isn't gonna work. Do you think there's any way to stop the elves from fighting each other? Had Freyr not abandoned the realm, a lasting peace may have formed. But now... Can we really place all the blame on Freyr? This war started long before his arrival. But he had the power to heal this land and end the war, did he not? He made his choice. The wrong one. For Alfheim, perhaps, but not necessarily for him. Well, I suppose we're all entitled to walk our own paths, regardless of where they end. I'm sure there's a way to set it in place with some highly targeted destruction. something up there.
here. The last time we were here, we killed the Dark Elf King. That's... unfortunate. I'd wondered what became of Svartlyoffer. We had to defend ourselves. But when he died, he told us we helped the wrong side. I see. still hear something wounded out there. I think so. It could just be the storm. Perhaps we can investigate once we've uncovered a mysterious seer's hidden prophecy. Unless that thing is a new temple guardian. quite nicely with the twilight stone. A knack for interiors, these light elves. It's facing the wrong way. Hmm. Maybe if we... Allow me to speed this up. The angle should work, Kratos. Chest there, I want my chest. Nothing. What's wrong? I could hear mother inside last time, but I can't anymore. Her soul is one with the light now, united by forces older than Odin himself. She is at peace, Atreus. I hope so. When father went inside the light, he you said he... went inside the light of Alfheim? Yes. And yet here you stand, of sound mind and decidedly not incinerated. You must tell me, Kratos, what did you see? That memory is for me alone. But I felt only moments pass. Didn't feel like moments to me. I was trapped. Atreus overcame great odds to save me. One could but only imagine. Well then... Groa's triptych awaits. So, did you ever meet Groa? Many times. But she was plagued by constant visions. Conversation was difficult, to say the least. Oh, here we go again.
father, she's... She's gone. We're almost there. Huh. They've changed some stuff. Last time, there was all this Hive stuff up here. So many Dark Elves. I... All this time, I thought the Dark Elf King... I thought all the Dark Elves were... Tear? Yes? Did we help the wrong side? Hmm. Are you certain that's the right question? I... What's the right question? Is there a right side? Exactly. What do you think, Atreus? Is there a right side in this war? I... I don't know. Then perhaps you shouldn't pick one. I wanna go inside the light. Ah, our friends. Do you believe in fate, Sindri? Oh, of course not. You think I'd wash my hands this much if I thought that what I do doesn't ultimately matter? There's only one thing with any say over how we live our lives, and that's us. Hey, Sindri, wasn't your forge on the other side of the shrine last time? My, someone's got an eye for detail. Perhaps the Light Elves felt it looked better on this side. They do have a thing for aesthetics. Honestly, I'm as puzzled as you are. But it's best not to look a gift forge in the two-year. Very messy. Anyway, good luck! Hmm. At least now I just have armor that I can just buy. Huh. That might be my best piece yet today. Gonna keep it spatter free this time, right? Kratos? What about your son?
What do you need? I'll take him. And in pristine condition, too. Yeah, but it brings out my strength. Giants always did enjoy hiding their secrets in plain sight. Wait until you see this. Yes. Here we have Groa's search for her missing husband. She was relentless in her attempt to find him. Meditated for weeks on end. Unfortunately, she found... something else. A vision of Ragnarok. Word of Groa's vision reached Odin. He sought her out. Demanded a private retelling. Didn't like what he heard, apparently. Ironwood? That's the... I don't know what that is. The mythical sanctuary for giants. Curious. So it's in Jotunheim? I know some giants thought so, but Ironwood isn't anywhere, lad. It's a concept, a metaphorical paradise. It's not real. Presumably, Groa requested her ashes be returned to Jotunheim, while her soul found peace in the light. Difficult to imagine Odin respecting those wishes. <clears throat> hmm. The champion? I think it's supposed to be... Me. You assume too much. Aye. Best not to read into these abstractions so literally. Prophecies are slippery by nature. Although, some are more obvious than others. Ragnarok. Aye. The end of everything. So this is it. There's Thor. nothing we can do to stop it. There must be a way. Why a else serpent. is this... Look. Here. This is what we saw. It's you. Fighting in Ragnarok. No. I don't. I can't. I didn't know that's Tear. What's this then? That's new. Asgard is destroyed? The other realms thrive? And Odin dies. She lied. Roa lied. Of course she did. <laughs> Odin's working off a false prophecy. <laughs> so then, we can win Ragnarok. We can beat Odin! We are not present in any of this. But that was Tyr leading the charge against Asgard. Plus, Hell's army was there. And the elves. Champion. Okay. Whoever that is, doesn't matter. But for the first time, we know something Odin doesn't. 
We just saw we can win. Tear? I won't allow prophecy to define my choices. But we just saw No, you. Atreus. This is wrong. much to discuss. <sighs> Man, it tear just dwarves Kratos. We can't stop Ragnarok. But we can win it if Asgard is destroyed. Odin will not be the only casualty. There must be another way. I still want to see what the new armor looks like, though. Mm. It was all right. I like my other one better. you see a lot Roa lied to Odin Ragnarok isn't the end of everything it's just the end of Asgard just the destruction of an entire realm is to say nothing of its citizen its wildlife those ignorant and innocent Odin's misdeeds enough there's much to discuss once we are safe at home well not our home Should focus on our egress first. Agreed. Maybe you can throw those back at us. Behind you, incoming. I forgot to pick up a resurrection stone. Greetings, boys. Good to see you. I think I was going to need it so soon. I think we'll probably stop the stream once we get back home. Damn it! <laughs> I do like the variations, like, uh... That they improved the um, <sighs> 
Sorry, uh, I like the fact that it gives. So, what'd you see? Oh. Roa lied to Odin. Ragnarok isn't the end of everything. It's just the end of Asgard. Just the destruction of an entire realm, is it? To say nothing of its citizen, its wildlife. Those ignorant and innocent of Odin's misdeeds. Enough. There is much to discuss once we are safe at home. Down here. I guess we're just going down. Four more arrive. Watch out! The wreck is going to explode! And down we go. He's really worked up. Think he's okay? Focus, Atreus. This way. Hope I get my chest. Ah! 
It is far from over. I... It's gonna be okay, Tyr. You've seen what is to come. I told you I would not follow you to war, and yet here I am, dragging an innocent, innocent? elf... ...and marching towards the destruction of Asgard. What choice do we have? There is always a choice! I will not lead you to war. I won't. I'm not that god anymore. I don't want to fight, but with you three, there is no avoiding it. Your path leads to countless deaths, unimaginable pain and suffering. Sir.
Hey, Tear? Thanks. And I'm sorry about before. I... I've... No. I am sorry. I should never have come. We shouldn't linger. I just want to do the right thing. And according to prophecy... Speak no more of prophecy. War will not give you the purpose you seek, Atreus. Only slaughter. So what are we supposed to do? Roll over? Do nothing? Enough! We will discuss our next move when we are out of danger. Can I have one of these shields? Ooh. Want one of those? Those? And oh yeah, definitely one of those. I gotta say I'm gonna, I'm gonna be doing a lot of in-game exploring. Dark Elf Assault. I'm so sick of fighting elves. Can't they just leave us alone? Well, I'm glad that they're probably pretty pissed at us for killing their king. We need to get out of here.
Matt. You've got this. <laughs> Can we leave now, please? Almost there. This way. Here. We... Open the gateway, please. yourself the legacy this one has left for the barons. I've had far more than I can stomach. We do not need to rush. We should see this desert for ourselves. Look, I know we can't trust prophecy, but I'm not sure we should just ignore what we saw either. We are not ignoring it. We will discuss it back home. For now. I wish to search for the wounded animal you heard earlier. You? Really? Yes. Well, okay then. Good. Yeah, lead the way.
Hey, Mimir. Between me and Tyr, who'd ever guess I was the giant? Huh? <laughs> Indeed, lad. Air higher. Why are we sending those ravens back to Mifelheim? Travelers. Atreus heard a creature in pain in the desert. Over a storm like this? Most impressive. You know how to pretty well, right? Do you have any idea what's out there? No, sorry. The elves and I... Long story, but it's best when we keep out of each other's way. Hive matter is... stickier than I care for. Good luck on your search, though. Stuff some cloth in your ears to keep the sand out. Don't knock it till you've tried it. Whatever you need. This axe just keeps getting stronger. Have we more to talk about? Well, I should probably pick up another um, stone. I'm here for you. Oh, got time to chat? Surprised to see you out here, Sindri. You must hate the sand. Oh, it is the worst. But with Brock banned from Alfheim, it's up to me to keep you ship shape and sharp. So why is Brock banned from Alfheim? Oh, that's, um, I don't know if, well, do you know what a juicy Noken is? No. Well, thanks to Brock, the elves sure do. Uh, what is a juicy No. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think either of us want to know. What are these animals? Gulon, native to Vanaheim. 
Not sure what they're doing here. Offering us a ride? Someone trained them to pull a sled. Lucky for us. Domesticated bullock. Most unusual. particular direction to find your wounded animal or are we just enjoying the weather i can't hear anything out here perhaps we find a cave first to catch our bearings I think we first we explore. Dwarven steel. Whatever's inside is kicking up quite a bit of sand. How do we reach it? There's caves and tunnels are plenty out here. Let's find one and see where it takes us.
Hmm. I don't think we can access this yet. A tempting treasure chest! Damn the sand! Not getting up there with all this sand in your way. Oh, you wanted a cave. That's a pretty big cave. Look, 
cave entrance. This cave extends underneath the desert. Is the creature within? Yeah, sounds like it. We'll find it if we keep going. What is this place? A refuge for the Dark Elves, by the looks of it. One of the few remaining now that they're barred from the temple. Great. Anymore. Oh, for Peeny's sake. Ugh. I guess we'll continue longer. Last. <laughs> <laughs> 
that I know more about the Dark Elves, I wish we didn't have to fight them. They attack us. Well, this is their home. And considering what happened the last time we were in Alphine, can you really blame them? Patience. A virtue or a threat? Depends on the reader. You heard. What does it say now? It's not always like that. Some animals are just. I feel what they're feeling, you know? And whatever this thing is, it's a lot of pain. I see. Why do you ask? I am curious. Really? I am capable of curiosity. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Yeah. 
bastard's Ooh. about to explode. Oh, this thing's no longer. <laughs> Uh, more bells. Okay, so we got one bell there. One there. Okay, so they're both here. We just gotta get across this. Gates, so I guess we have to come back. Ow. Uh, that wouldn't let me do it because there was a creature. Okay, so one there, one there. And we're back in the same room. I thought it was here, but no. So one bell there. C R. So we're looking for an N bell. Knowing what I know about these chests, the rune should be close by.
Like I said, I found two of the bells, but I can't find the third. Be all the way out here. I want to say it might be in this room here, but... You know what? I, I just have a growing suspicion that it's in that room, so let's try to get to that room. trying to figure out why you'd help some random animal. Is this not what you want? No, no, it, it is. I'm just surprised it's what you want, too. So I'm going to do it this way.
Boom. I'm really getting sick of that. The elves is making it pure darkness. So pissed off at these freaking dark elves, to be honest with you. Oh, for Pete's sake! Oh, no! Ah! 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 
Come on! God, that is so annoying. <coughs> I think that's because I'm fighting a freaking general. Come on, man. Jesus! Watch your right. Yeah, the fact that I have to deal with not just him. I have multiple of his uh, multiple of his little lackeys I have to deal with plus him throwing these dark bombs at me. That's bull. Well, not bull. It's fun, but it's like Jesus, man. See what I mean? It's just ridiculous. Come on! Enough of this black crap, dude. Come on. 
About time. Jeez, dude. Get out of my way. We have to kill a bunch of dark elves to get there. I remember a young lad who, until this very moment, would take on an army of Draugr to save a wounded animal. But these aren't undead Draugr. They're elves. I just want to make sure we're not repeating the same mistakes. Getting involved where we shouldn't. <laughs> it looks like the boy's getting some wisdom. Oh man, that was a bit of a cluster right there. It's just the the black bombs really got annoying. And how do you expect me to get through this? Never mind. Never say no to a free chest. I don't think I get the angle right on this one.
I need to break all three of these, I know. But... Hmm. What to do? What to do? Does anyone else think that looks like a horn? You know that one will break that one. This is the way of progressing. Gosh, the energy's gotta be right here, man. I did it!
Birth my own noggin. It's just, why does it feel like no matter what we do in Alphine, we wind up hurting Dark Elves? We are down here to help the creature you heard. I know that, but I'm usually the one who drags us around trying to rescue animals. Why do you care so much? There's something you're not telling me? No. That one was easy. Maybe a Kratos just wants a bonding experience with his son, you know? I don't know. Okay, I think I got at the wrong angle. Ow. Oh man, I'm gonna be so mad if we have to do the puzzle again. Yeah, we got all of them. Found it. Just 
Look at jellyfish. Hey, Gaffune's ghost. That's the largest bloody half you have ever laid eyes on. It's not just in pain. It's trying to sing. It's the song of the sands. You don't normally sing like this underground. Is that what's causing the storm? Aye. Judging by all this hive matter weighing it down, it's been trapped here for dozens of winters. Don't worry, Luke. We'll get you out. What is that name? Well, the last good thing we saw was Diener, so... Oh boy. While I appreciate the attempt at humor, that little brother is truly awful wordplay. <laughs> oh, well, can't all be winners. There's got to be a way to clear those rocks. Get a better angle. I'm sorry, I missed that. What did he call the darn thing? Word. Oh, he called it lunch. That's a, that's a terrible thing to call something, dude. He's like, oh, well, the last thing we called him was dinner. Like a giant jellyfish to me, but I love the design. Awesome. First, we meet a giant whale that's like um, Gambu. Maybe now this is Norse mythology. All right, so. I think this is the way we came in, isn't it? Yeah, it is. If it's giving back the marker like that.
So all I really need to do. Ah, here we go. They trap it down here. Hathkifers are known to burrow, so I'd hesitate to place full blame on our dark elf friends. But it's trapped in their hive stuff. Hive matter doesn't belong to the dark elves, any more than the light belongs to the light elves. It's just another of Alfheim's natural resources, one the elves have used since the time of their ancestors. And while the light elves seem keen to banish the hive over on their side, the dark elves make effective use of it out here in the barrens. So, by clearing out all of this hive, are we hurting Dark Elves? You wish to leave the creature enslaved? No. Then let us free it. Whispering slab. Chest armor. Strips of resistance. Ooh. I like these. I don't know why I like them, but I like them. What's in here? Just mopping the floor with me. I like it. I don't like it as well. <laughs> oh, oh, okay. I was like, ah, oh, don't tell me. I have to Oh, my God. 
Understand these poems. Oh, there's always meaning if you look hard enough, brother. It's all in what you bring to it. <laughs> okay, all I need is arms. I like to. I like to look at his armor. Be if I'm going to be 100 percent honest. you hunted. I wonder if it might be worth visiting the Raven Tree. This is the spot. We can cut the half goop and loose here. I don't know how long it was going to be before we saw this. It flies? Of course it flies. It's a half goofa. Sounds much happier now. And hey, the storm's gone. Aye, perhaps we'll finally earn some goodwill from our dark elf friends after all. Look, Father, thanks for bringing us out here. To do this kind of stuff just to keep my mind off Ragnarok, you know? This was not a distraction. No? Then why are we really out here? Have you ever considered he just wants to spend time with you, lad? While he still can. Really? We do not know what lies ahead. But if Ragnarok approaches, I wish to enjoy the time we have left. I. I don't know what to say. Thank you. For bringing us out here. I'm glad we did this. As am I. Damn it! <laughs> no kidding. I don't want to like leave an area until I'm done exploring. But it's almost three in the morning. <laughs> Oh, 
I look okay. Behind you, watch out. So Damn it! Come on! Ah, the generals are suck. At least every time I'm going to call them the generals. Like, right where I needed to pick that stuff up. Every single time. Dude. That doesn't help me much. Uh, dude, get out of my way. I don't think this relic actually helps me much. I think I was gonna survive.
Okay, so I just don't think this relic is really doing it for me because this one actually gives me bonus melee damage. Show it to one of the dwarves. They'll know what to do with it. Ooh, maybe a new weapon. I like this armor. It, I don't know, like... It gives me 34 strength, defense, and rune! And luck. I like, really like this armor. It's really good. And strength and defense. So this is really good. I'm probably gonna go up, go ahead and increase it. Or at least he's not saying boy, but it kind of been nice if, like, Mimir, like, read them and kind of described what they were for, you know? Well, not what they were for, but kind of with the story behind them. I feel that was a little bit of a missed opportunity right there. Or, I don't know, maybe that if you go into the menu screen, they'll actually let you do it. I don't know.
Okay, we've been here. Oh, I gotta remember to ask Pierre about his travels to the lands beyond the seas. You wish to travel the world? Maybe. See new places. Find out more about myself. Hmm. Not a bad admiration. Something I want to do before I get too old. Cause we've been th we already been inside the remains. Okay, I think this is where we climbed out. I just don't want to leave this place unexplored, you know. Like, I don't want to leave any chests behind. Feels like this could be a boss fight. Boss arena. Yeah. No, let's try that. No. Pretty much you have to read all of this. So... I feel like that's a little bit of a missed opportunity that they could have had Mamir, you know, maybe not like read it word for word, but, you know, maybe a little bit like a paraphrase. All right, just grabbing a little snack.
I feel like there's just gotta be another way. Sorry. There's gotta be another way of doing that. Got it. Father, do you ever wonder if you're doing the right thing? I think we got with this place almost thoroughly explored. I think there was like one or two chests so he couldn't grab before. Sentry was a great blacksmith. It's a magical shield. It just feels natural. The shield is well made. Hold that thought. I think it's about to get violent. It's 
Oh, come on, so close. Brother, I had a thought. What if we took a stealthy approach to our next battle? No. You're on fire, Kratos. It will pass. Do you mind, dude? Every time! Come on, dude, it's like right on me. Every You jerk! I miss the, the ability where Atreus has had a, those animals come out, but nope, they took that away too. I guess they found that was a little too OP too. Ah! 
Oh, damn it! Yeah, this is so much fun right now. <laughs> oh, man. I try to pick up health, he's right on me. All right, we'll come back. I'm gonna go get my since it's actually pretty close to the gate, I'll just go and get myself a, a resurrection rune. Jeez. said souls come in four parts. Does that mean you can lose some of your soul? But not all of it? Aye. Form, mind, direction, and life. Lose any one of them and the entire being suffers. Still, sometimes luck alone is enough. Just ask your father. My success does not come from luck. Ah, they're a fane of the eternally lucky. <laughs> Lovely crystal work and those elven gifts you found. I'll be happy to pay you for them. I'll disinfect my tools. Something in mind? I am, as always, at your service. I'll heat up the forge. Oh, look at how much... Just to get the resistance stuff up, I'd have to have a lot more dwarf and steel. Damn. Still a pleasure to see you anyway. Alright. Now we're prepared now we're back into action. There's something I'm not sure I quite understand. In the Ragnarok prophecy Odin knows, all the realms get destroyed, including Asgard. In the version Groa kept secret, Asgard still falls. Wouldn't Odin have tried to prevent it either way? What difference did her life really make? 
I think of it this way. When it comes to subverting <laughs> prophecy, knowledge is power. Without the full picture and context, the finer details can lead you to tragically incorrect interpretations. Enough. We will continue later. Poor bloody dropper. <laughs> Get away from me, dude! The one of the axes is it's fucking in it's freaking insane. I can't even get health in this fight. It's ridiculous. Just get him off my back for a few minutes. I could get this done. Because he starts resurrecting a whole bunch of his cronies. Oh, you... Then he does it we can Oh shoot, I had I still had a resurrection stone. Damn it. This one's hard. I like these because they're hard, but it's like jeez. Oh, I 
Got it. Whatever. Reminds me of tales of a cruel empress. One too angry. We will see. Dust of the realms, hex silver. tough it was the fire that got me it's like hey you were talking about how Fenrir's soul is headed to the light of Alphon that's because he was a wolf right aye were he a god or a human who died in battle a Valkyrie would have taken him to Valhalla or folk bomber had he been a human or god who died outside of battle he'd be cast down to hell height. but Fenrir was a wolf so his soul will join all the others in Alphine with mothers Yes. Like your okay, been there, done that. Now, if I recall, we were discussing how manipulating the details of a prophecy can wreak havoc on the believers. Back in my homeland, I was privy to the operations of a certain coven of heath witches. We're keen on destabilizing the government. Hold. We will finish later.
Alright, so one more. How to do it. Wherever that little candle is. So, oh, hang on. you do to distract yourself they are not distractions oh of course not i just thought it'd be nice to learn some music you could teach me and no it's stupid never mind overthrew a government using only deceptive prophecies. They picked an influential thane, an otherwise loyal man, and fed him a story of his own ascension to king. Let this wait. Stay alert. anecdote about the heat witches. They fed the Thane a prophecy of his ascension to king. They dressed it up in enough details they knew would come to pass, so when they did, the Thane took it as confirmation. The next thing you know, he's helping matters along. He murders his king, sleeping under his own roof. Murders many he once called ah! friends, too, thinking them fated to oppose him. Then, for a finishing touch, the witches revisit this usurper. With just a few details structured ever so misleadingly, they convinced the fool he was invulnerable to all threats. Physical, Physical or magical. magical. Aye, aye. But was not so for him. All turned into a rather magnificent bloodbath as they go. The Thane ends up without his head and a name so cursed none dare speak it. All thanks to a subtly deceptive prophecy. Set that aside for now. Come. Then this is the last thing to explore. Sort of a harp. I can play beautifully, you know. I do not. I would prefer it remain that way.
Okay. I mean, if only I could get closer right here. No, I don't think you can see that from the outside. I can't really get a good angle on it either. So whatever I have to do, it has to be inside here. There we go. <sighs> All right. Looks like some kind of creature died in here, though. All right, I think that's about it. Let's head back to, well, I guess what we're calling home today for for this game. That's it. Oh, almost dead, sorry. There's one more thing here.
know I look like you. In what way? Like, bigger. And do I get muscles like yours? When you work for them. But Baldur was really strong, and he didn't have any muscles. My strength does not come from my body, but both are honed by discipline. What's that mean? It means you've got the strength of a god no matter what, lad. But if you want to seek of one, you'd better start picking them up and putting them back down. <sighs> Did Kavas your stories? Give him here! Huge fan! Want something in particular? And in pristine condition, too. <laughs> Thanks for grabbing this. One more time here. Oh, why? Huh? Why? Dug up some new blueprints for you. What'll it be? What? You just came to stare? Hmm. Like the father of all, we swung from the tree. Wisdom gained father, Swung from the tree. In life we hanged, in death we kneel. Ooh. Those are cool. Until you freed us with your steel. So destroying the ravens free their spirits somehow. Good to know. Free. Well, free of Odin's control anyway. So we just gotta keep on killing more ravens. Gotcha. I think unless it's a cutscene, I'm. Tears had enough time to find his equilibrium, or whatever. Indeed, I saw flashes of the old god of war in him, but they were fleeting. There is nothing wrong with opposing war, nor opposing prophecy. I suppose that's fair. Never can be quite sure what the giants meant by any of it. Am I the only one that remembers they predicted our entire journey to Jotunheim? If the giants saw Tyr leading armies at Ragnarok. And I believe that. The question is, how you'll ever make Tyr believe it. Now, this is the cutscene. I'm probably going to close the stream once we get to the um, house. Alright guys, so this is a good point to save. I feel like we did a lot. I mean, we cleared out um, Alfheim. We're going to have to be coming back and doing 
a whole bunch of exploring. Um, because I got a feeling there's a lot of places we can't go because we either don't have the tool or the power to do it. Um, and I've noticed something on my blades. Was like, yeah, it looks like we got a little bit more of a, the runes. So the more you upgrade, I think we're going to get it. But it's weird that we get that when we already had it. I guess that just shows that the, the blades were debunked in this game. Um, a lot of cool side activities, like freeing the animals, I really like that. It kind of reminds me of the dragons, but it, it looks like they went bigger. They went with a a different designs for each one instead of releasing the same thing four time four or five times um and they're all epic like the big jellyfish i love that the design of it was absolutely fantastic um the whale with like the city on top of it kind of reminds me of like genbu you know the turtle that has a city on its back well, that's the only one in comparison. I'm not brushed up on the, uh, the the Norse mythology. Um, the game definitely is tougher. Um, like, I'm playing this... Uh, let me see if I can get into my menu. Yeah, I'm playing this for on balanced difficulty. So I get those who... Uh, I get the story... Who wants story focus gameplay with some focus on combat, balance equality focus on combat and gameplay, no mercy for those who want. So okay, so this is basically the difficulties you can have. Um, story, I'm imagining everything is a lot easier. Grace. So I, I guess I'm playing this. I, I don't know if it's normal or if I'm playing this on like hard. Because, uh, so there's easy, okay, there's normal, so I'm actually, I think I'm playing this on hard, I can actually decrease the difficulty, but where are we going so far into the game, why don't we just keep it as is, um, and then there's God of War, for those who want the game as difficult as possible, God of War mode can only be selected when starting a new game at the start of the menu. So you can go ahead and change your difficulties if you want it. Um, I'm just going to keep it on balance. Um, oh, even... Can we change the text color? I'm not going to mess with any of those. But um, tomorrow, we'll, oh, I should say technically today, since today is Saturday. Oh. Oh. Sorry. Um, so later on today, we'll be doing another God of War um, playthrough. Some more God of War for you guys. Um, as I said, I know I'm going to play the absolute crap out of this game. Um, whether I play uh, play through everything and find everything, I don't know. Um, but definitely, um, I could say this for positive. If you guys play the first God of War, you guys are going to know what to expect. Um, the game, the, the combat doesn't change a whole lot. Um... Like, I thought maybe they'd be adding a cool weapon, you know, um, to give you some um, diversity. Um, 
I don't know. Maybe we will get a new weapon to play around with. Um, but if they don't, I feel like that's a little bit of a missed opportunity um, to kind of change things up a little bit. But not saying that that's like a, the be all and end all of the game. Um, because they definitely give you some, like, some of the enemies have been revamped with different attacks. Um, I would actually, if I was playing this, if you guys played this before, uh, the first God of War, I recommend probably playing it on Balanced. Um, It feels like also they took away some of the mechanics from the first game as well. So the first game, like you had a tray as you can, you can press and hold it to charge up the weapon. Actually, I don't think I've actually, I'll check that up tomorrow. Um, where you have like animals, but you can see the animal selections in the ma in the, um, your skills tree. But it doesn't seem like Atreus will get like, I think he's going to get, probably t from this, just look at the tree, maybe two more abilities. But I don't see that he can... Summon animals like he could before. Before. I mean, to be honest with you, <clears throat> that was actually pretty repeat. Pretty OP. You could stun a lot of enemies, excluding the Valkyries, um, if they got caught in it. Um, and it looks like they kept, um, like the the Viathan weapons, pretty much the, the weapons, pretty much the same. So if you wanted a like a rune, like the Flames of Anguish or something like that, you would have to find it. Um, so I'm wondering if they t what they took out as far as those go because there was a because my setup for like Valkyries and stuff like that big boss fights even though there was really a lot of boss fights I mean it was just basically either the Valkyries Boulder that's about it but it seems like they um, are trying to emphasize more on the boss fights in this one so. Um, but it's not like you're fighting the same boss over and over again. Like, we even had a troll fight for a second. But it wasn't really a fight. It was just a cutscene. <laughs> and I didn't push a button. So it was like, okay. You know. Um, we, we are induced to a few different bosses. None of them are, like, overly hard. Um, but they do have different tactics. So it does force you to kind of change things up a bit. Uh, either choose between, you know, you have to dodge attack. And they took... I think I want to say they took an idea, I think, from like Sekiro. And the reason I bring this up is like Sekiro, because in that game, there are blockable attacks, or should I say like parryable attacks and unparryable attacks. And it'll be highlighted in red. Um, and they did that here, is that you can parry yellow attacks coming at you, but the red attacks are unparryable, unblockable. So even the, even the yellow attacks, they can actually knock your shield away, but you can go and get, like, kind of dodge out of the way, but it kind of will stun you for a moment. Um, so definitely there's some changes in combat. Um... And then, they added uh, some different armors. I mean, if you look at the armors I've collected so far, they're actually, like, uh, here's the one you can craft. It kind of looks like this one, but um, kind of different. I really, I still like this one. I think this one's like a pre-order, was a pre-order though. Or is it DLC? But I think I like this one because it makes it look like actual snake, like snake scales. I don't know. I, I just really like this one. Um, so far, I've only found one of each. 
the just the light runes. So I'm waiting till I can find like the the heavy attack runes. I'm guessing like if we get like a uh like the I think it's called Ares. I can't remember. It's like an Ares attack. Um, that will be here. So it's not just like you can equip two runes. It's just I, I don't know if it was like broken down into heavy and heavy and light attack runes. I think it was just two runes, I think. Um, now, one thing is, like, we get a kind of a different shield because the shield we uh, was broken at the very beginning of the game. Uh, the only thing is, I hope we did different designs, and it's not just this design, these two designs, that's all we get. And we do get to have um, more... You can, um, you can upgrade as well, though I haven't upgraded it yet. Um, now, my question is... Oh, so... You can actually now increase... I didn't realize that. You can actually increase your Spartan Rage. That's why they have it as an equipment, not just a power-up. So... Um, I'm going to have to wait until I have more Kratos XP. So... I can get my Spartan Rage up there, because I'm probably going to need it. <laughs> um, they also added a new mechanic, a new piece of equipment called Relics. So each Relic has its own ability you can use. Um, like, for instance, this one grants a... Boost grants a boost in rage that applies to, and applies stun to your nearby enemy. So when you activate, all nearby enemies will get stunned. This one offers uh, bonus melee attacks, which I really like. Um, I've been using this one more. It's a really one you can get really early in the game. Um, Now, the one thing I wish we could do is, like, take the beard off of Kratos and just, like, give him, like, his old style. I, st I, still, I still opt for that. Like, I still want that. Like, we can just shave off the beard and just give him a nice goatee. But anyway, guys, um, I'm going to call it here. Um, I want to thank every single one of you guys who came out and watched. You guys are A number ones. Absolutely amazing. Thank you guys so much. Hope you guys are enjoying the God of War Ragnarok stream, a.k.a. God of War Ragnarok game, as much as I am. Um, I really love God of War. Um, I've been a fan of the series since the first ones. I just don't like the portables. Um... And I look forward to playing this some more. I hope you, again, I hope you guys are all having a Wookiee-tastic day. And I'll see you all on our next adventure. Till next time. See ya. Oops.